What's up guys? Welcome back to another video and this one is our first part in a series of videos that we're going to do about the cost of living and the difference between New Zealand and USA. So we're going to start off with a trip that many of you guys make on a you know regular basis which is the grocery store or we call the supermarket here. So yeah, we'll just take you inside and show you the difference on prices of you know certain things and uh, like just some essentials and you know some other stuff that we usually get in one week's worth of shopping for a family of four. So we'll see you inside. No junky snack food. Yeah, no junky snack food. It's already starting with the yeah. nagging. But like junk food and like chips are an essential part of your week. Like, You're an essential right. path to your death. An essential part of your death. Okay, here's our first um, thing on the Bacon. Bacon. $17 for so cool. one right. kg. We're gonna get a kg of bacon. Okay. Toilet paper. What do you need toilet paper for? <laughs> what do you need toilet paper for? <laughs> because it's a pandemic. Everyone gets toilet paper. Oh yeah. Look at that. Yeah, we got loads here. It's a gold mine. <laughs> you, make it, you can make a throne out of toilet paper. We should be in the garlic growing business. Nah, that's per kg. Yeah. Yeah. Should we get one or two? Oh uh, no, I like to get prime. Yeah, get prime for sure. Prime beef mints. We'll get one of those. Not the junk mints though. Yeah, get Charlie's. Nope. Yeah. Hold it up. Nice. Cheese. Cheese. Yeah, I need the big boxes, guys, because they probably wouldn't even bother for a little. Cocoa Pops. Down the bottom there. So interesting fact in New Zealand is we actually don't really have jelly, which apparently uh, one of you guys said in our uh, American Snacks video that jam is actually different from jelly, whereas I always thought that it was just the same. So what is jelly? Jelly, I think, I don't know, it's more of like a, not really, not in this form. Jelly for us is like that, put, like the dessert that you put in the fridge and yeah. make it, get it to set. Oh. Yes. Everybody knows raspberry. Raspberry? raspberry. That's our favourite, eh? Yeah. We'll get raspberry. So hold it up, buddy. Raspberry and peanut butter on toast. Um, Creamed honey. My favourite. Dutch coffee. How many you reckon you can do? I've done 17 at home on the big bar, about like that high. Is that your record? Okay, but here's the extra challenge is that you have to do it while it's still rolling. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nice, eleven, twelve, <laughs> thirteen, up. fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 
18 mil. 18, you beat your record, man. Oh, legend. Legend. Pound it. Mate, I pro I'd probably struggle to do about three. High grade flower? Yeah. Okay. $20. White bread. Average white bread. <laughs> cookie time. Original cookie time cookies. Though so these are like our version of um, Chips Ahoy. That's like, that's the Kiwi version. Okay, so we've done our best to show what the average weekly food shop would be for us. For a family of four. For a family of four. That would fluctuate a little bit depending on if you were buying nappies, um, shampoo, extra like hair products toothpaste all of those extra things that you only buy mm. occasionally we've sort of we've got a few extra things of some things and not others so it would be around about what we've spent today weekly and if you were super careful with money you could probably get it for less we have shopped at a store that's traditionally cheaper than all of the other ones in New Zealand it's New Zealand owned and operated yep. so these Pack and Save does have the best prices, so yeah. this is probably quite a good indication. Obviously, you can see we've bought things like three of these. And we try to avoid deals where we could as well, just so you guys yeah. could get an accurate price of the actual item. Exactly. Um, and then, yeah, something like that, obviously we wouldn't buy next week or the week after because we've already got it. But yeah, you get the general idea about food prices and what things cost. So yeah, that's it. Nice. And the grand total is? The grand total was... $332.85. So there you have it guys, back in from the grocery store and uh, let us know, uh, you know, down in the comments, another video idea that you guys have or another comparison that you want to see in the cost of living series. What do you guys want to see next? Do you guys want to see some fast food or do you want to see like, uh, you know, how much it is to fill up your car? Give us some ideas down in the comments and uh, we'll make sure we add it to the list and we'll, and we'll definitely keep going with the series. Cool. Or maybe like housing or... Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, how, uh, we can go through anything. Just let us know what you guys are interested in seeing. Let us know. Yep. And we'll see you in the next one. See Bye. ya. Bye. Bye.